Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Felicia I'm from Taiwan. Firstly, let me explain why I'm dressed up like this before we get into the episode. You guys are probably gonna be like, Whoa. This is just a YouTube episode. Why the heck is she wearing a leopard dress? I was going to an event today. Obviously, I spent time to kind of pick on my outfits, do my makeup. While I was going to this event, it just started raining like crazy in Taipei. It's so crazy. I got off the metro and then I spent around like 10 minutes walking back and forth deciding whether I'm gonna go to the events. It was literally impossible to move. Because I didn't go to the events, I was just feeling very annoyed and bothered. So that's why I was thinking, okay, I have to get home and then just film so I can maximize effort of putting out makeup. So that's why. Okay. Now we're on episode number 9. I will be doing something very interesting. This is a vlog of how I practice my choreography and dance in general. Without further ado, let's start this vlog. Let's go! Day 2 practice. I came here yesterday as well, so been waking up at 5 for the last two days. Yeah, I have some progress to make. I want to finish re-choreographing one section of the song. That's the goal. And hopefully I can get to the entire song so that everything will be refined and then I can just focus on practicing, practicing and then just repeating it until it's good. Alright, so I'm gonna just start dancing now. Tripping off the ass to think I just unlocked a new emotion Anxiety, a little dash of serotonin I don't like to see it all clear I like when life's distorted Whenever I was here, I used to turn right to the Don't run right by the river where we can't hide Heard you smoking now, goddamn Hope it isn't true, cause back then you was my best friend I'm so dead. More than three hours of practice. Almost non-stop. I only took like a 15 minute break in between. Yeah. Now I'm just gonna pull up. Look at all, all the people here dancing. It's so fun. Everyone's dancing to K-pop. <laughs> only me playing English song. <laughs> so there's the anti-fragile group and there's new jeans. Over there is probably new jinx as well, I don't know. Got the beats? Yeah, got the beats. What is it? Girls, no, girls on top. Yeah, girls on top over there. My muscles are still really sore from yesterday's practice, but I already feel like I want to come again tomorrow because today, oh, thank goodness, I finished everything. I finished fine tuning everything, so now I re choreographed some parts. I was a little bit worried because at first I was very stuck. I was like, oh, I'm gonna, I don't know how to make it good, how to make it more like. You know, natural I guess but I did it so I feel very proud of myself yay all right gonna play some music and then cool up what else yeah um, yeah that's it I'm gonna go get something very delicious today I've been craving for it so I'm very excited to get it I think I'll just continue listening to Rihanna her music is a bit different from the ones I've listened to but more ballad and also it's more smooth I think so that would be a good choice for now since I haven't get I haven't been listening to this type of music so let's see watching we are at the end of the video i hope that with this video you can kind of have a better understanding of how i practice my dance after i finished my choreography i was quite 
confident and really satisfied with the outcome. But whenever you start filming, like whenever you start a kind of the evaluation of your progress when you film yourself and you see yourself in the camera, you're like, oh, it didn't turn out as I expected. Uh, it's not as good as I wanted. So that's what happened to me when I first filmed myself. I was like, oh my god, I suck. I feel like it just always starts like that. And so I feel like we should not be so frustrated with our progress and the, especially when if we just we're just getting started. That's why I feel like it's even more valuable to document your own growth because you will see how much you have come through and how much you have developed from the very beginning. I just want to show the value of practice and then uh, to cherish the progress. All right. So that's about it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And as I said before, please continue to follow along the journey. And I will see you guys in the next one. Before then, take care. Ciao. Bye.